had a SHR28 and the fault is uh, it's been reported with uh, no functions in the basket and throwing up the different campus error codes uh, at the moment I have started the machine up and um, there is no error codes present in display uh, if I look in uh, the pedal position or the joystick position that's all centered and I will show you that right now So that's uh, pedal positions and the all of them is responsive. Okay, if you go into the joystick, that is responsive as well. So now I'm going to try to lift the console up and see if I can generate some errors just by moving the console. Machine is at the moment set to the cage controls and look, just moving the console, our console lid, I have came up with all these errors, okay? So if we go to error codes now, we're gonna have a selection of the error codes. All of them are present. We got the joystick. Now this is no longer responsive. And if I go to the pedal position, they're all centered, but they're not responsive as well. Okay. Here we are. So I think what's happening here is, um, it's either with a loose canvas connection or, uh, or is adapter issue here on the joystick. Let's see, I have seen that before. So we'll try to look into the adapter to start with and then um, we're gonna see from there. Let's lift the console open here. So all the wiring seems to be okay. The only thing I would note is that this green wire it has to be connected to this shield. It says shield wire and that one is a shield as well. So they should be connected together, which is for some reason it's taped up, but uh, we can fix that, I think, just by pulling it out. And I'm gonna loosen up this uh, the green wire so it can be connected here, okay? But I think that's not a major issue, is a main issue here with this adapter. And, uh, I'm gonna look into that. Nothing obvious. Okay, so that's looking not as bad. And this is the canvas line. Can low can high, so they looks they looking good. The just connector is alright. All these terminals are looking good. Okay, so let me reset the machine, restart the machine, and then I'm gonna try to do the same thing. But in this case, I'm gonna use, I'm gonna leave the joystick is disconnected, and we're gonna see if we're gonna bring up any of those errors again. So I have restarted the machine up, uh, I still have my joystick here, adapter, and uh, at the moment I have only one error code. And that is 01C2 double zero double two zero. So let's see what does that mean. So that should be actually joystick error. So let's just double check on that. Um, so if you need the error codes, just go on the Nifty website. There's a look up there, so you can type in the error code and then it tells you what that is. So 01C2 double zero double zero. So that is. Yeah, there is no, no canvas communication with the drive joystick, so which is exactly what we would expect. Um, so I'll try to move the console around now and then let's see if we can uh, trigger this fault again. So here it is, yeah, that's the error code. So I'm going to try to move the console again, just as we did before. Ok, 
okay? There is no problems. Alright, that's good. So see the way that adapter or the joystick uh, itself. But uh, let's try a new adapter here, so I have a new version of it. So this is a new one, it has a, is a new version and you can see that by last digit number 4, so it's a 004. Uh, that's a new version, it has a gold plated connections on it or gold plated contacts on it, so that should be some improvement. So let's try this on and see what's going to happen. So here it is, new adapter. So let's try to see if you can trigger any errors let's move the pencil around so at the moment i have no errors at all okay so we're gonna test the joystick it's responsive as it should be yeah everything's working we're gonna go in the joystick position so that's a drive joystick trigger left right forward reverse so that is responsive too we're going to try to move the console about shake it all about and then uh, see if it's can trigger any force remember before we just had to lift it up slightly and uh, that was enough I think that's gonna be just good as new. Okay, so new adapter fitted on and uh, I tested out that it doesn't fail anymore. As you can see before, when I was trying to lift the console up just slightly and that triggered the fault already. So it seems like that's where the problem is and uh, we'll try to reassemble now, test a bit more, but I'm pretty confident uh, that's gonna fix the problem. So that's been tested all working fine, so just before I go I want to check on the fuse here Just to test the ground fuse and see if that's okay because if that fuse is not as good then it can cause uh, problems with the canvas communication so Just remove the fuse, get the continuity checked with the multimeter And then it's gonna be done It's gonna be finished So let's see hear the beep yeah so the fuse is good so yeah so good so the machine is working fine so I'm just gonna put, put the fuse back in and then uh, it's all fixed just adapter no scanners is needed just move around and look it's it has failed right away as soon as I move the console lid up and uh, that is a good indication. That is a problem with the wiring or adapters. In this case, it was adapter. Um, all right, that's it for now.